remember, so much is on the line here at 140 pounds. Saucedo has been destined for greatness for so long. The hype has been building. A win tonight, and possibly lined up to fight undefeated Maurice Hooker, who just won the belt from Terry Flanagan. Both of these guys made their reputations within the boxing business at the wild card. Years ago, Lady Z came from Australia. Freddie Roach put him in with Miguel Cotto, and he impressed. Oh, savage shot. Saucedo attacking that head, left and right, as Lenny Z comes back. Look at the experience now coming in. You want to talk about experience and guts from hurt and battered to now a left hook that has the undefeated hometown kid hurting badly he better and backed up. He better hold. Lenny Z going Look for at it. this action from Lenny Z. Going for broke here in round number four. A big right hand. Alex Saucedo stood up to it somehow. Finally ties up for a moment, but quickly a break. Can you believe this fight? And a cut on Saucedo's right eye as he takes and takes and tries to get more. I asked Lenny Z yesterday, what happens if he loses? There is no losing, he said. Absolutely not. He, he is. knows this is his last shot. This is basically the Maurice Hooker's title. This is his last shot to get there, to get that title. Squared up, throwing punch after punch after punch. He's going for it. Blood streaming down the face of Saucedo as well as he lands an uppercut. We, we've talked about Lenny Z's cuts. Saucedo is cut in his last two fights, and this is a gruesome one above his right eye. There you go. Saucedo loves to fight that mid-distance range. You don't like to use his height. Guess what? Lenny Z knows that. And he stays there after every combination, doesn't move his head, and Lenny Z, an aggressive counterpuncher. So Saito landed a right hand that opened up the cut even worse on Lenny Z, and Lenny Z stands up and just fires back. This is outrageous. Let's see how they finish it up. Let them take it home, boys. You can take your list of round of the year and put it in big marker right now. Here's how it all started. And you see Salcedo jabbing right there, a little bit too close, tried to throw a hook from the middle and got clipped with the right hand. There it is, overhand right. Jabbing or throwing a punch from the middle, whether it's a hook or a jab, Lenny Z stepping right in with the overhand right. He changed levels right there. Look at how clean their faces were at wow. that moment of the fourth round. And then they were just drenched with blood for the final two minutes. Over there. 